Hey everyone, welcome back to Castlevania. Uh, I have died a number of times in the music box, but that's okay. Uh, <laughs> I do this for your amusement. So, I, um... Okay, I need to focus, because I have actually died quite a number of times doing this music box. But that's okay. Now I know exactly what to do. Alright, so, wait oh boy okay life gem life gem life gem life gem thank you ha! all right so now I go back the way I came oh which merely is an exciting prospect we can skip this too no, no checkpoint either. Holy fudge, man. This game plays for realsies. Alright, but we have the, um... We have the life gem, so we can make mistakes. Oh, my goodness. I am, like, stressed out now. <laughs> like, actually, though. Oh, boy. Alright. Do this. Alright, we don't need any more shadow magic. Okay, that's good. One, two. Whoa! Go, 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 go! No, don't do that. Alright. Oh, fudge! We didn't need to do that. Alright, that's fine. No, we can make mistakes. Oh, boy! <laughs> uh, I guess we'll wait for yellow to play out. And then we need to um, get through on green. Oh, boy! I think we're going to do this. That life jump is so helpful. Oh, man. We needed that. Oh, and if I die, I have to go all the way back to the checkpoint. Ugh. Okay, so I think I'm going to, like, just try and dash across. Okay. One, two, three, four. Okay, we'll wait for this. There you go, that's Blue Rose. Oh boy! I thought about running and I was like, I don't know if we actually need to do that. Yeah, you can have your rose, I'm done with it. <laughs> now give me passage to the land of the dead, please. Cool, and we got all the magic gems, so I never have to do that again. Oh, boy. No, it wasn't that bad. It wasn't like I was playing for half an hour and I couldn't do it. It was more of, um... It took me about five tries off camera to do it, but, like, that was only about, like, ten minutes. So, like, it, it wasn't bad. Definitely not as bad as I remember it being, so that's, that's very nice. Chapter 10. Titan Graveyard? Oh, boy. Baba Yaga sent our hero to the Titan's graveyard, and I have sent her soul to the underworld. She will trouble us no more. Now my friend enters the land of the dead, and his final battle is coming. I must find my own path and try to meet with him at some point. For now he is on his own. The land requires sacrifice. Sacrifice I hope that he can make, because without it, he will not get very far. I must have faith in him now. The seed was sown long ago, and it flowers beautifully. He has come this far down the path. I must believe that he will go all the way. All right, Patrick Stewart. Dude, if he doesn't sound ominous by now, then like he'll never sound ominous. Holy crap, I do not remember this at all. This is amazing. What is this, Halo? That wasn't really a really funny joke. Everyone, just like turn off YouTube right now, or click, exit the tab, and uh, never come back, because I have failed. All right, I, um... 
Oh, yeah, we can climb. Duh, I'm a silly goose. I thought we had to use, like, the air vents for a second to, like, climb upwards, but, uh, no, that wasn't the case. We just, we just climb. But we could always climb. Um. Oh, thank you. I'm glad you could see that, Gabriel, because, um, well, his perception must be off the... Oh, my goodness. So I, I, I think before I was saying the line of the dead isn't very pretty. Uh, discount that. This is beautiful right now. What was I on? I was like, oh yeah, it's a lot of browns and stuff, but I mean, this looks pretty good if I must say so myself. Holy. Like, I got like, this is the beauty of playing a game that you've forgotten some of the details about. Um, because when you forget some of this beauty, you're just like, wow, that's, that's amazing. And so you might just be thinking, man, like, he's gone on about the beauty of this game for too long. And it's like, dang it, this is my last play to do what I want. But then, of course, you guys don't have to watch if you want to. Yeah, here you go. This is kind of what I was thinking about. Lots of, uh, brown and stuff. Yeah, mainly, like, I, I mean, I don't think that looks as good as some of the other environments. But, hey, man, it's a graveyard of titans. And that's actually really cool that he uh, had all these titans. Throw back to the earlier chapters. Which is weird, because like, at this point it feels like so long ago. Um, yeah, I guess we just jump here then, eh? Not much else we can do here. Alright, we'll halt. Oh, skeletons! Oh boy! I guess I'm not going to animate those. I, uh, I suppose we'll just leave them alone because we're good people like that. What are you doing? No! That was the wrong jump. Oops. Oh, that was bad. Oh, and then of course we get the checkpoint too. Oh! That was a lot of poison damage. The camera angle changed on me, which is why I think I'm with my jaw. Hello, where are you guys? I have nary an idea what you guys actually are. Oh, and the skeletons are up too. Alright, what are you guys? Creeping corpse. There's a strange magical root that only grows in the land of the dead, which feeds on the carcasses of dead creatures. This plant consumes all the organic material around it, and after it's satiated, evolves from the corpse, it is ingested to become a living being. Once fully grown, the creeping corpse looks for living creatures to devour. Yikes. That sounds not pleasant, if I do say so myself. Oh, we're getting, we're getting destroyed here. I'm telling you, man, the skeletons are dangerous. And I know I was like talking about them the whole time. I was like, oh yeah, the skeletons are coming back. But no one believed me, did they? Oh, he power attack. Okay, I need to actually get my blocking on. Thank you. Oh my goodness, I want to be grabbed again, actually. I'm sure we'll see another. Dang it, those skeletons play hard to get. Dang, I keep trying to block the power attack. There you go. Alright, whoa, that was tough. We used up all of our light energy, which is not great. Alright, so now we need to figure out where to go, which, um, 
You know, if I'm being honest, I'm not... Oh, hello. What do you have for me, sir? A scroll. One must learn shadow magic in order to truly understand the evil that we face. One must become evil in order to destroy it. There's no place in heaven for us where we become that which we fight against. That's actually really interesting. And I'm going to leave the episode here because you might be like, Oh, but what does it mean? All you guys think about that. So, I was hoping for more of like a philosophical like bent to this, but I, I, I can't drop the ball. But anyways, thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys next time.